Mr. Williams back with another breaking bag. How y'all doing? A lot of people did not like the fly episode. I thought it was brilliant. I loved it. I don't see why a lot of people had a lot of shit to say about it. It was kind of it was kind of a slow episode, but it was brilliant. It was very brilliant. Just Jesse, Walt, and the fly. Throughout the whole picture. It was brilliant. No, not, not that fly. Anyway, um, a lot of people did not like the fly episode, but I enjoyed it. I think it was brilliant, brilliant, brilliant writing. You know what I'm saying? The fly like kicked walks ass through the whole picture Jesse end up killing the fly and the motherfucker fell in slow motion <laughs> that shit was brilliant man but I didn't understand one thing at the end when Walt woke up and the fly was like right there on the light when it was blinking what did that mean was that was that representing something Whatever you kill comes back and haunts you. What'd that mean? It couldn't be the same fly. Was it the same fly? I don't know. Anyway, y'all, let's get to this episode. Breaking Bad, Mr. Williams. Yo, I thought I was going to see some, like, vaginas. Georgia O'Keeffe painted all kinds of stuff. Oh. Everyday items, her surroundings. Does chick have medical issues? This particular painting? Mm. Is it a door? You know, I, I, I don't get it. 
Why would anyone paint a picture of a door over and over again, like dozens of times? But it wasn't the same. Uh, yeah, it was. It was the same subject, but it was different every time. The light was different, her mood was different. She saw something new every time she painted it. And that's not psycho to you? Well, then why should we do anything more than once? Should I just smoke this one cigarette? Maybe we should only have sex once if it's the same thing. Whoa, no. Should we just watch one sunset? Or live just one day? Because it's new every time. Each time is a different experience. Okay, fine. Okay, so the universe took her to a door and she got all obsessed with it and just had to paint it 20 times until it was perfect. No, I wouldn't say that. Nothing's perfect. Yeah? Some things. Smooth, smooth. It was so sweet. I think I threw up in my mouth a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> you can't admit just for once that I'm right. Come on. That O'Keefe lady kept trying over and over until that stupid door was perfect. No, that door was her home and she loved it. To me, that's about making that feeling last. Yo, that's the cigarette Jesse was looking at in the last episode. Man, the writers of this show, what they had a fucking time machine when they filmed this shit? They, they like thought about shit like episodes in advance. Like they filmed shit it's like they filmed the last episode, then filmed the episode before the last episode. It's like, these motherfuckers are brilliant. Everything, like, ties in to, like, the last episode. Fucking brilliant, man. Come on, give me a step. Give me one step. Come on, Hank. Come on, Uncle Hank. You can do it. How else are you going to get out of here? Don't you have any friends? I mean, Jesus. I had something better to do. You going to get me out of here sometime today? This guy? You're going to start coming in weekly. So. You're sure you can do this? <laughs> He's watching his ass. He watching his ass. Just say it. Just say the words. You think I'm stealing? Also tells me that I have to move forward. Always good advice, at least for me. I see we have some new people here at group. A couple new faces. See some hands. <laughs> Great. Welcome. Maybe we can go around and introduce ourselves. Say whatever's on your mind. How about you? You want to start us off? <clears throat> yeah. My name is Andrea. Uh... We don't bite. No judgments. You can be as open and honest as you want to be. Honestly, I don't want to be here. Damn, that's real. Right. He said be real. Well, send their hand up. Well, hello. My name is Brandon. And this is, I believe, Peter. I'm Peter. How much have you sold? sold? I sold a tenth. One tenth? That's it? Yeah. Jesse wrong for this shit. To who? Look, it's not so easy selling to these people. They're here trying to better themselves. I want it back. All of it. I'll sell it myself. Come on, man. Don't be like that. Selling to these people, it's like shooting a baby in the face. It's not natural. Yeah, Jesse, it's not so easy like you think. I'll show you. 
Andrea, right? Man, don't tell me he finna turn this chick out. She kind of cute too. Since when? You don't turn sixteen for two more months. It doesn't matter. It's a provisional. Look it up. They changed the law like ten years ago. Oh, well, I didn't vote for that. It doesn't matter if you voted for it. It's the law. Probably table this discussion for later. Your dad and I have a couple of things we need to talk about. So. Okay. A 1971 Model Corn Fastback in grabber line with a shaker hood. Mm. Stang. I'll write that down so I don't forget. Oh, darn it. No pencil. My guy is a tough guy. Who is he? Huh. What's his name? What are his qualifications? Walt. His money has to be unimpeachable. And if it is, it will be. But how do I know that? I mean, apparently you can't even tell me the man's name. Jesus, Scarlett, do you really want to know? I mean, do you really want to know? I mean, you the one suggest the shit. I mean, now you, now you bitching. <laughs> Look at this chick staring at Walt. Look at this chick. <laughs> Look at this chick. Y'all see this big. BBW blind looking at Walt. <laughs> I mean, she's just staring at Walt like, ooh, you, ba you bald white man, you. I want to eat you up. Get in my belly. Right now, get in my belly. Come here, I'm going to eat you. I'm bigger than you. I'm higher in the food chain. Get in my belly. Help. Clearly, his taste in women is the same as his taste in lawyers. Only the very best with just the right amount of dirty. <laughs> Walk you through the process. Uh, first step is something we like to call money laundering. All right. Take uh, your money uh, represented uh, by, say, so. these jelly beans. <laughs> <laughs> so I actually, I know what money laundering is. Uh-huh. Well. Yeah. And uh, as with most things, the devil in the details so to begin with what are we saying is the source of this money drum roll please wait for it laser tag <laughs> laser tag seven thousand square feet <laughs> rocking fun doesn't make any sense makes more sense than you two being together i'm still trying to figure out how that happened do you even know walt i mean saw is a goddamn fool damn she giving him the yams that quick? <laughs> I know. It's just... What? I can't get caught using you. Here we go again. Here we go again. Okay. First of all, Jesse is wrong as a motherfucker. All right? Now, he's one of my favorite characters, but this motherfucker is wrong, man. Wrong. Wrong in every way possible. This chick is in rehab, same as his last girlfriend, Jessica. She can't get high. She trying to get off the shit. Jesse going right back down the same motherfucking path. But I don't think he tried to get Jessica high. He actually cared about her. He was like, didn't want to do it in front of her. Right? This show was filmed like what? 10 years ago? Over 10 years ago, maybe? I don't know. I know it was like a decade ago. The writers of this show had a crystal ball and they can just see into the future in 2021. Because this is the new way. No date, no meeting your parents, no going to the movies, nothing. Just go home and give up the yams and get high. Like, do we even know her last name? Mommy, mommy, hey, baby. Oh, you're 
your nana brought you home early. Jesse, she's grandma. Desgraciados. Sin vergüenza. I feel the same way. I feel the same way, Grandma. That's fucked up. Jesse, this is Brock. So you, uh, you cheered, huh? Brock is almost six. You okay? With kids? What? Uh, he's cool. Buck is gonna go play. Yeah, Jesse do like kids. He's gonna go play with his Legos and his cars. Say bye, Jesse. Bye, Jesse. You, you twisted claws. son of a bitch. Oh, I fixed it. My involvement in this is ongoing. Understand? I can't just quit. She she is really getting on my nerve. Something. Of I mean, she act like. All very safe, professional structure. But I can't simply quit. You worked here four years. Car wash. It's a business you understand. It's a story people will believe. Badger still eating them damn donuts. Hey, um, Jesse. The two of them doing here. What do you mean? Look at you're not up to sell. It's funny that you're coming. Homie, I'm on like step five. Deuce, yo. I'm catching up. What? You like that? It's science and stuff. It makes it do that. Here you go. Could you do like chicken firecrackers? Firecrackers. Um, you know. Don't have any firecrackers on me. You don't need to be playing with that shit, boy. Tomas. You shoot your eye out. You look like a little Tuco. Hey, that's mine. He should have said that shit was tight, tight, tight. That's what you want to buy. I once convinced a woman that I was Kevin Costner, and it worked because. Right? It's nothing to do with the story. Besides, this dump isn't gonna work because it doesn't have a Danny. Danny here. What in God's name is it Danny? Danny runs the laser tag. In other words, Danny can be trusted completely. That guy, the guy with the uh, the eyebrows that won't quit, is he a <laughs> Oh my God, I don't hurt it all, boy. I don't hurt it all. Oh my God. That guy right there, you see him? Y'all see him? That guy right there. The one with the eyebrows that won't quit. They just won't quit. <laughs> what? You know that blue stuff you were talking about? You had a line on some. I don't know what you're getting so pissed about. Just a load of kids. You brought it up the other day. Yeah, that was before I found out you got a kid. What kind of mother are you? What? You heard me, what kind of mom gets wasted with a little kid to take care of? Nobody can say I don't take care of my son. You're gonna come in my house and judge me? Like you got no responsibility, so it's okay for you to get high. Look, I, what do you know about me? I don't know what you've been through. You can tell me if you want. Give Tomas a piano. Gave him a choice. And uh, some dude. So he did it. Told me all about it like it was nothing. So you killed. What do you think? I'm some outside crew. Right around the corner from here. Over off the of central. Just rode up on his bike and shot him. Central. 
we shot the guy by three in the morning. Shot him dead. That's she Como. She talking about com Combo. Son of a bitch. I told you, man. These riders are fucking... They from another planet. The writers of the show is from another planet. This is like top notch writing. What are the fucking chances? I know Jesse's heart dropped down to his asshole right now. Whoa! God damn! Who's going to be released at the end of this week? You'll be just as comfortable here as you are here. You'll have all the same equipment. All the same equipment? What the fuck? The Don't equipment have... that you have here, that you need, short term. You'll do your PT at home and it'll be great. The hospital bed. Well, put a hospital bed in my bedroom. Hank, you'll be home. Get that out of my house. Without a Danny, the car wash isn't really an option. And he can't get you another Danny to run the car wash? Easier said than done. What about you? What about you? Right. Me. I'll be the Danny. No, 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 Skyler, that is not a good idea. I'm perfectly capable of managing a small business. A and legal business, not this. Who else could we trust? No. Walt, I'm in this. And if I'm in it, I'm gonna do it right. You are not in this. You are not I'm in married. this. I'm married. How am I not in not this? No. Married, Skyler. We're divorced. You forgot about Ted? Right? Married couples can't be compelled to testify against one another. Okay, she right. Married couples, you know what I'm saying, it's hard to testify against each other, all right, if you're married. That's right. But how can I put this? Skylar right now remind me of that chick that you've been trying to get with, you know what I'm saying? That gorgeous, fine, beautiful, thick chick with the nice tits. And just the nice legs and fat ass and you've been trying to get with her and she ain't wanna have nothing to do with you when you was when you wasn't hitting on shit. You didn't have a bag, you was a square, you ain't have no nice ride. I mean you ain't have no 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 pad. I mean you ain't have shit. And but you trying to grind and get your shit up. You know what I'm saying? And she ain't even trying to feel you, you know what I'm saying? And then as soon as you come up, now she all, y'all ever seen um, Head of State with Chris Rock? This what this shit remind me of. You know what I'm saying? When Chris Rock was uh, trying to run for president. and But before he was running for president, his girlfriend left him. You know what I'm saying? Cause she wanted a, a big house and she wanted diamond rings and she wanted all this shit and Chris Rock couldn't get it all. But the moment he became president of the United States, she tried to get right back on his shit. This is what this shit remind me of. If y'all ain't seen that movie, check it out. Head of State. Every time I see Scott, I want to call security. Security! Do it. Are you seeing somebody else? I'm seeing everybody else. I've met mosquitoes with more force than you. I'm tired of your little games. It gives me great honor to accept the party's nomination for president of the United States of America. Good evening. We're getting married. Oh, I'm exhausted. <laughs> you know what I can't decide? I can't decide whether we should have a DJ or a band. DJ band. DJ band. DJ band. Security! 
Is he? That's correct. Who's that, Gus? Yes, sir. Okay. Okay, I'll be there. What was that? An invitation. Walter, you're right on time. Please, come here. This motherfucker's like come a... On. Cook. Normal person. It's got a this nice pad. This is a Chilean dish that I love, but I never get to make it. What would you slice the garden? This yeah. motherfucker is weird. It always amazes me the way the senses work in connection to memory. I mean, this stew is simply an amalgam of ingredients. Neural connection. The senses make the neurons express signals that go right back to the same part of the brain as before, where memory is stored. It's uh, something called relational memory. Uh, don't quote me on that. I, I'm rusty on my biology. It's very interesting. If I was at that dinner table, I'd be like, what the fuck are y'all talking about? You are a wealthy man now. And one must learn to be rich, to be poor. Anyone can manage. What advice do you have for me? Never make the same mistake again. Damn, that shit real. Jason, what the fuck are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? Your ass better be strapped. Fuck, 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 fuck. Hey, sup? Bounce. 